What's going on guys, it is Michael. Welcome back to a new video. And before we get into this video, I would like to thank the sponsor. It's a new cooking competition show coming to Upwave on HLN called Cook Your Ass Off. Except there's a little bit of a catch, it's actually healthy cooking, kind of like what I do here on this channel. Here's a little preview. This is Cook Your Ass Off. Celebrity chef Richard Blaze hosts a cooking competition where incredible cooking and healthy food fight to coexist. Everything I learned in culinary school has just gone out the window. Dishing out the drama. Oh, man down! The delicious. Wow. And the nutritious. You nailed it with the use of nutrients. From the producers of Chopped. Get ready to cook wow. your ass off. Series premiere Sunday, December 1st at 7 p.m. on Upwave on HLN. The show premieres Sunday, December 1st at 7 Eastern Time on Upwave. If you want to see more clips from the show, you can click on the annotation right here. Anyway, the recipe that I have for you guys to try out today is a 10 minute pizza recipe. One of my personal favorites. And like always, there are a ton of different ways to customize it and tweak the macros to whatever fits into your diet. You can add more chicken for more protein, a different type of cheese for less fat, and so on. Now let's go ahead and start this video. So what we're gonna use for the pizza crust is one pita. But if you don't have one of these, you can use a lavash bread. These are great, I picked these up at Walmart. The brand is Joseph's, and these are huge, and they only have 100 calories for one whole sheet. So you can either make one of those, kind of a thin crust pizza, or just stick with the pita. And the first thing that we're gonna do is take one teaspoon of olive oil and drizzle that on top of the pita. And the next step is to add the sauce. There's always options for this as well. You can't go with two tablespoons of tomato paste. Or if you want like a barbecue chicken pizza, you could add two tablespoons of barbecue sauce. But today I'm just going to stick with the tomato paste. So two tablespoons of that. And then we'll add our spices and seasonings. Just keep it simple. A little bit of basil and some oregano. And then of course, if this is a pizza, we gotta top it off with some cheese. I'm just gonna use regular mozzarella cheese. You can use low fat, you can use the fat free, and the macros will change slightly based on what type that you use. But I'm gonna use a quarter of a cup of this today. And for the toppings, you can use whatever you want. You could use mushrooms, peppers, onions, whatever you like, turkey, pepperoni, chicken, it will all taste great. But I went to Walmart and picked up some Canadian bacon. I'm gonna use a couple slices of these on the top. Now this is gonna go straight into the oven that I have preheated at 400 degrees Fahrenheit. We're gonna leave that in there for around 10 minutes. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So here we are 10 minutes later, I just took this out of the oven. The crust is crispy, the cheese is melted, and the Canadian bacon that I added on top is done. All in all, this is a great snack or meal, just based on your macros and your calorie needs. You can make one, you can make two, you can make multiple at the same time, but they're gonna take 10 to 15 minutes to make total, which is great, so give this recipe a shot. And that's all I've got for this video, so I hope you enjoyed it at home. Sorry I had to do a little sponsor, I have to do those every so often just to keep the channel going. It helps me out and I appreciate you guys understanding. If you like the video, feel free to give it a like and a comment down below, I would appreciate that. You can check out the cookbook right here over to the side of me or it's down below in the description. And if you use Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, I do too, so you can follow me there if you want. Those are also down below. But thanks for watching and I will talk to you next video.